Hey, it's Tay and Peony here, episode 29. Come on, Tay. There's my girl. All right. We have missed y'all. I was away last week, and I thought Taylor was, but little Ladybug had a trick up her sleeve, didn't you? I did a short episode, two minutes. Hmm. Maybe you should pause and go see who's trying to break in the house. I'm sure it's destiny. Oh my gosh, okay, but how about, it's like, um, y'all know the movies where you're watching something and, uh, something, um, the movies where the, the boyfriend is talking to the girlfriend and, um, she's like doing a little strip tease or something and then some man comes in behind her and kills her. And I would if that just happened. I bet we'd have a lot of views. Then, huh? What are we talking about today? Okay, so, um, I would like to talk about what I'm, a little, I can talk about a little bit of what I'm going through because I haven't talked to Ladybug much, so I don't know what he wants to talk about, but I had the gastric bypass. Mm. It's been, sorry, let me get the food out of my mouth. It's been, the lighting's good, okay. You look like somebody I know. Anyway, guess your bypass? I would look good in the worst lighting. Yeah, you would. So how about that? I gave him that confidence, y'all. Or the narcissism, I'm not sure what. Um, focus, son, we're talking about me now. Um, okay, so we're here at my mom's house, and I moved... Um, from where I was to here, uh, my mom passed and we're trying to sell the home. When I came in here, I had no idea. Um, they've turned off the water and said that how in the world this is possible, but this is no exaggeration, $4,000 water bill. So um, there's clearly a leak for like a, over a year that um, mommy was in the hospital. Um, go on and on. Point point is now they want a thousand dollars. It doesn't matter that we're in the middle of probate. It doesn't matter. They want a thousand dollars to turn on the water. So this is how people have to live without water. Um, I am a member at the YMCA. So um, due to so after I. After I work out, I can shower, so so there's that. And, um, are you okay over there, girlfriend? I'm good. All right, we're Gucci over there. Oh, he's putting in his tongue ring. You gotta keep talking about the gastric. Oh, okay, so gastric bypass. Um, I kind of wanted, I wanted to talk about what's going on with me right now. I, as anybody out there, um, I know I've witnessed this a lot, taking gabapentin or neurotin, um, same thing, um, and then later on, or if, or your family members are later on had trouble walking or holding things, um, they say, um, you know, in the warnings when they're like, oh, blah, 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 this could happen, blah, 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 yada, 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 yada. Well, one of them is can, the, the opposite effect is can um, cause nerve damage. Long-term use could cause nerve damage. And I was on it for a long time, so like 40 years old, I, my head looks big. Put, come in closer. So at 40 years old, <laughs> Your head is big. I woke up and um, it started <laughs> where like I could barely walk. And I remember now my mommy kind of went through the same thing and she was on also gabapentin. Um, a few of the other people from my meetings, I started going back to meetings because uh, of this pain and I didn't want to start going down junkie alley again. Um, and I forgot what I was saying. Anyway, nerve damage, so they're gonna check in, um, do an MRI and see exactly um, what what's going on. 
on with me so that's pretty frightening because I'm actually having to use a walker and little things like me running into the store or or me doing anything is is painful and um, it's very time consuming and now I don't have water so yes am I complaining this whole episode maybe maybe hmm. so the gastric the bypass. gastric bypass uh, I had 20 let's see how old's destiny uh, 20, 20 years old yes yeah, she's 20 so 17 years ago I had the gastric bypass and I was basically the um, what do you call it when they try things out on you I was like the test dummy yeah that's one thing I was like the test dummy <clears throat> and they left out, um, you know, just bear with me with the words because I could be a little bit off. They left out the small intestines, the part that absorbs all of your nutrients. So I have to go to the cancer center monthly and I ran to a lot of other people there that's had the gastric bypass. So I know a lot of people are wanting to be skinny and I'm telling you, don't do it. Don't do it. It killed one of my friends the other one had to do a reverse gastric bypass and they do they do that um, however that was only because she had the the lap band where they could reverse it mine if they had to reverse mine I would die because you can't reverse it or, th or they would have um, that part of my stomach is gone so I have to intravenously, um, not me, but the, the hospital has to intravenously monthly put on uh, the nutrients back in my body. So I'm constantly tired, constantly tired. Um, and it makes it hard, it makes it hard to have a relationship. And you know, however your relationships are, I heard it say, said, it was probably said a lot better, but however your relationships are is a direct, um, image of, of how your life is <clears throat> you know if you're having all bad relationships your your life isn't isn't shiny at that point so it's hard to carry on a relationship when I'm so tired and I need to put forth effort into that relationship and still have some energy for myself so I know a lot of other people are going through this and um, if y'all want to uh, let me know how it is that y'all cope with it um, I like to swim. That's my little getaway and I used to really love yoga, but now with my retarded legs I can't really do that so um, I'm trying to figure out You know this this new journey of my life. I know it's all for something and um, I just want it in my timing. I don't want it in God's timing. I want my timing I want this to be over with I want to be able to walk and I will be so much appreciative of the little things. But I did want to give you a big thank you to the in front of the World Wide Web Tay because you were quite the the gentle woman, gentleman. Um, um, this past trip, um, getting out getting out my walker and getting me settled in without, I didn't want to do it. You did it. You did he did. I didn't want Nobody to do it. asked him to do it. He just did it. And if you didn't want to do it, that makes it even better, even more special that you did it. So that's there's that. But I could have did it myself. I do it myself all the time. I don't think so. What how do you do you just think I sit there and wait <laughs> until mean, somebody walks you by? Ask for help. No, but I feel comfortable asking you for help because I would, in return, give the help to you. Like, you know, today, when you wanted to borrow, you know, some of my lady stuff. What do you mean? You wanted to borrow some lady stuff. That was just a couple of tampons. <laughs> don't get, don't get it twisted. Sir. <laughs> Uh, remember Alex Jones we were talking about? So, um, also in my neighborhood, no. what's going on is, um, it's crazy. Y'all can Google this. This is real facts that this, um, right, this man, um, was at the grill, went to go, I guess, start dinner, maybe for the family, and the wife 
allegedly shot him down. She's in jail, so I don't know who else would have did it, but he's standing at the grill and got... I'm not laughing at all. Like the, I'm just, Around here? Yeah, this happened around here. Um, this happened. Like, this has happened so much. Like, everybody is killing everybody. And, I mean, what in the hell is going on with the world? I know I've jumped from no water to fat surgery to to the shitty world but I just that's kind of the what I'm going through right now what I'm living in and I know secrets make you sick so I am freeing myself and I think my son soon will follow me and free his self well you don't need a free I don't know I'm just talking Tay well I was trying to talk you in erosion okay go ahead Remember Your Alex, turn. Alex Jones we were talking about? Yeah. No. So he has to pay, I think it was like $47 million to the family that he said their child wasn't dead. Oh. That happened like last week or something. Oh, yeah. And I tried to follow it. Um, I, I couldn't ever watch it. Like, I don't know. I tried. Oh. I don't think you saw. <laughs> what? I don't think you did. But did you see uh, Trump's house was raided in Mar-a-Lago? No. By the FBI? No. Uh-oh. Did we have a dirty president on our hands? Hmm? Hmm? Did we have a dirty president on our hands? You have my glasses on. And you know what? You also got my Ray-Bans. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. You had my Ray Bans. Mm hmm. Yeah. You better not have lost them. All my kids use my stuff, borrow my stuff. Um, it sounds like someone's at the door. Someone's at the front. Please pause. It's gonna be Dee Dee. No, it's at the front door. It's at the front door, dick shit. Hello? Ooh, it's getting exciting, guys. So back in my childhood home, um, I'm just reliving a lot of... Nobody? That's crazy. Uh, that just, like I was just saying, um, I'm reliving a lot of my memories of um, active addiction and getting married and being married and going through that. But one. I almost had to take my bus off. Oh, no, don't do that. Oh, no, he almost took his blouse off. I think so, it's serious when my blouse comes off. It does, I know. What about the crops? Practice correct posture. Oh, okay. So, um, that's one of my... If it ain't tight, it ain't right. Oh, okay. Ow. Ow. I can't really do that. I'm broken down there. Okay, so. You want boobs like mama, she, huh? She's up. Are you going to cut this part at least? And then we'll no, start it? so what were you saying? I'm, I'm hiring a director. Um, so that was one of my memories was um, I remember calling the police and I said, I said, I think someone's trying to break. Because you know what you just heard. So imagine being all geeked up, all geeked up, not slept in a couple nights and you heard that. So I called the police. I thought for sure somebody was coming in in my home. And Where was this at? Here. Really? Yes. This wasn't, this is when I was um, getting high a lot. Um, oh, this was a long time ago. Yeah. So I called the police and um, the first time they come out here, they were kind of nice. Like I called them out here three times and they finally asked me, um, you know, what, what had I taken tonight and um, could they get me um, some help in the hospital. <laughs> That's embarrassing, but it just made me feel good because I heard it again. And um, my daughter here, she she heard it too. 
Yeah, it's just windy, I guess. It was supposed to rain today. I hope it would. We need it. It, it did rain today. I don't think so. Yeah, it did rain today. No, I don't think so. I think it might have rained in your head. I was out in the rain. No, I don't know about that. You might have been in the pool. <laughs> <laughs> Why would I lie about it? You might have heard the, rain. The, my windshield, wa I went and seen my dad, and and he told me, turn off, doing? turn off the windshield wipers. My dad's doing okay. Um, he's in the late stages of COPD. So that always makes me a little sad, but Smurf, um, my other mother, will take all the prayers that you can throw out there. Her name's Lori, in case you're writing it down. Yeah, she, um, well I can't say what I said I wouldn't, but I will tell you off air so that you can check There's with a lot her. of mass shootings going on. A lot of shootings are going on. So could you, so tell me what you think about this reporter that, that said, did you hit play? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> tell me what you think about, um, all of this. All of what? The shooting? No, about the guy that was like, it was all, it was all made up. It was oh, all. Oh, Alex Jones? Yeah. Um, it does sound like what somebody's up to do in the house. Uh-huh. Um. Well, I think um, what he said was wrong. He went back and said he was wrong. Um, I think he should pay uh, for the money because he, he's got a lot of money. He started his own uh, brand and has his own news network and mm -hmm. stuff. It's called, uh, what is it called? Infowars. Okay. Mm -hmm. um, Let me play the devil's advocate. Um, just because he's got money, um, I think maybe he should pay for what he earned off of it or what he profited well, off of it well that's what his lawyer said um for the amount of time he didn't cover it long he just covered it i think it was like uh a total in 18 hours so that's through a couple episodes i could be wrong on the hours i think it's 18 hours so what the lawyer said it came out to be through those 18 hours 250,000. so that's what the uh alex jones lawyer was asking uh to pay but the other lawyer the other lawyer was doing a lot more emotional, like trying to feed on the emotional side where the, uh, what is it, not the def- Um, the, uh, um, you have, I know what you're trying to say. Defender, defender. Yeah, you have the, um- He was saying, look at the facts. Okay. Defense, lawyer, mm -hmm. and then you have the commonwealth. Mm -hmm. Okay. The prosecutor. Yep. Yep. So yeah. defense lawyer and prosecutor. So the prosecutor was trying to feed off a lot of people's emotions and it worked because he's having to pay that. But the defense lawyer was saying, hey, he talked about it for 18 hours. This is what it comes out to be mathematically if you uh, do it like that, 250000 So, I mean, he should pay the family saying, you know, it was a school shooting that their son died in and he went and said uh, the school shooting never happened and he was trying to ask questions on it because he's a conspiracy theorist. So he's always trying to question different things and the FBI and CIA has been known to um, cover up and hide a lot of stuff like a lot of these um, you know the riots and the protests the black, and stuff um, the Black Lives Matter Black Lives Matter it could be um, you remember the uh, Capitol riot mm -hmm, mm -hmm. oh yeah yeah there is people out there why did they, why did they uh, run up in the Trump's house. Oh, they said he had documents in his safe uh, that were um, important. Where did you? Where do you find all this at? I don't YouTube. watch the news. I guess YouTube. Oh. And I don't even click on it. It pops up on my little YouTube mm -hmm. thing. Mm-hmm. So no matter where you run from, it you're gonna find news. Uh huh. Because I don't sit down and watch uh, mm -hmm. on TV news. How do you um, know? The difference in fake news and like what this man, this whole Alex, you know, how do you know the difference? Well, Denzel Washington had this great quote I've seen online a long time ago. If you read the newspaper, you're misinformed. If you don't, you're uninformed. Yeah. So what do you do? And then he said, that's a great question. What do you do? Because all these people are lying. They're not, uh, they're not 
they're not, I mean, they're all slanted. CNN's Democrat, Fox News is Republican, then you gotta find something in the middle. InfoWars is more like a conspiracy site. I mean, you gotta, you gotta look at the facts and do your own research, I don't know. It's like that one um, that I heard, uh, everybody that throws shit on you isn't your enemy. Everybody that gets you out of shit isn't your friend and do yourself a favor and close your mouth when you're going through shit basically stop saying everything to everybody who was that who was that I was awesome. oh my gosh anyhow did you leave the boy by self Oh no, Tay, he's like one years old. Okay, well, that's probably what we're hearing at our doors. Child Protective Services. Um. And uh, so today was also to, to touch up on relationships and boundaries. I don't know how we do that. You don't know how to do boundaries? No, I don't know what you mean by that. Okay, so... Say... So, for the viewers, don't get the gastric bypass. For the viewers, the gastric bypass is done totally different now. Just do your research, do your homework. Um, you know, they they did a small psych eval on me, if you want to call it that. I mean, everybody knew how to answer it. Um, the problem is, instead of eating and that is what a lot of people that are as they put it um your bmi has to be 40 your bmi is like 40 or something like that is that a lot your bmi uh-huh your bmi like yeah, your body mass and that's um, a lot okay <laughs> i think women i know men it's 20 Supposed yeah. to be 20, then women yeah, are 30. Then it's, yeah, then it, it's supposed to be... Then it, at 40, you get approved for the gastric. And you... Where are you at the 40, though? Well, I was... Yeah, I was. And then right afterwards, I had lost a couple pounds. But that didn't matter. Did you shut the shut the door? What door? Any of them? The front no, door? No, no. It's alright. <laughs> oh my god. Do you still have your staples in? Um, no, no, they've they've been gone. Um so after that, after that surgery, um I think no, that's not the one where they had to there was one surgery where they no, it was. Yep, I've had to. They had to go back in me. I think twice since then, just to make sure that that, that bag is intact. And um, yep, he's had to go back in me a couple times. Should you maybe see if it's shut? No, we're good. Okay. <laughs> we got two minutes. Um, okay, but I I'm not gonna say don't do it because I enjoyed being small. Um. And it served my purpose at that time. I think that, you know. Corn fed beef cabbage. Corn fed beef cabbage. And I couldn't eat nothing like that. So, to end on this note, when you had spent all that time in, in satisfaction, you know, that's what you consider satisfaction is is, sh is just shoving your face with food what are you going to fill it with so everybody I knew choose drugs and alcohol and you know to stop the food it's like what are you going to fill it with did I just say that yeah so a lot of people get bored and you gotta have something to do you gotta have something to do you gotta, you gotta have something to do. Nana did say, um, a long time ago, she seen you walking down the street with the beers. <laughs> and she said, I don't know how you drink that on the gastric. Ah, ha, ha. 
Yeah, I did. I drank a lot. And honestly, I, I think that's why I was able to um, ingest so much soda. So, 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 no, not soda. That gave me such bad gas. Um, I was able to digest so much um, food. No, I didn't mean to say food. I meant, Beer. sorry, I got lost. Um, pills. I think that's why I was able to take more pills than the average um, because it wasn't breaking it down the same way. Yep. Well, episode 29 has been very informative. Uh, I heard we got a new viewer. Y yes, I believe that's what it looked like. Where I'd you? hope. Um, he's you know, he's just a friend of mine. He's a friend of mine, and he, um, yeah, he's a, he's a friend of mine. Is it granddaddy? <laughs> you just can't stop, can you, boy? No, is he not our friend on there? I don't know, he might <laughs> unsubscribe. Oh, no. This uh, has been episode 29. Uh, do what you do. Have a good week and like and subscribe. Like and subscribe. Join us on Instagram, TikTok, Facebook, TikTok, and YouTube.